Well, hello everyone, and welcome back to Medieval Dynasty. So, look at this! Look at this! Are all the cabbage that we uh, fought so hard to get planted in the last one. <laughs> well, okay, that was mostly me bungling. But um, it's ready. Look at that. And we also have carrots, as well as oats. Now, the oats bring up an interesting question. Because, yeah, I think I messed up. Well, actually, I didn't really mess up because I did buy rye in order to be able to make animal feed for the pigs. And so that that did go to the intended purpose. But um, what I don't have is rye seed because, well, uh, let's take a look. So if we go like this, there we go. Rye, it is now the first day of fall and we need to make sure that we have at least rye planted so that we could basically uh, get on the animal feed cycle. Like we could keep on making animal feed. Uh, with rye and oats. So, yeah. <laughs> it's, a, it's a bit of a thing. We're going to have to get on that. So 53%. So the pigs are doing... Look at them. They're so cute. <laughs> They're sleeping. And they have enough food here. What's in the sack? Nothing. Okay. Um, so yeah, they are... Um, they're they're going to need food. And I'm going to need to get some rye. And can basically process the rye to get the seed so that I could plant um, in this season. So that's the, that's part of the plant. Oh my goodness, there's a, another rabbit. I picked up a rabbit last night. <laughs> I did a little bit of uh, after hour stuff. We're gonna need to make another, I might have enough sticks, but I'm gonna get some more. Um, I did pick up, uh, uh, do a little bit of work after hours um, before going to, well, technically I didn't sleep last night. I, I basically just, in this game, if you, if you keep, uh, what the heck? Okay. If you keep working, um, then, like, uh, until the end, essentially it'll just... It fades to black and goes right to the next season. So I didn't even technically go to bed last night. <laughs> so Baldwin is probably... Um, well, she might be a little upset with me. Either that or because of her nature, she could be like, Oh, he's he's working so hard to keep this uh, village going. Yes, Baldwin, I am. <laughs> I am. I am, I promise you. Wow, look at all these sticks. Okay, all right, I think that's enough. The other, I'll show you what else I, I, I gathered in the night. Um, but I, I, I converted all of the the uh, linen, the flax stock into linen thread. So that's done. Let's see, we're gonna, we need to make a bird. No, a rabbit, a rabbit house. Uh, you know, pop top, convertible. <laughs> uh, what did I do? Uh, let's take a quick, take a quick look. Uh, inventory, right. Uh, so I gathered, um, well, okay, so I converted all the flax stock I had, so I only have four left, but I made 38 linen thread, so we have linen thread, that's kind of cool. Also, uh, I gathered, uh, technically it's food, uh, a bunch of nightshade. Why? Um, because it's here, and I didn't really know what else, I thought, you know what, if I could have it, it's, it's, uh, you know, it's good to have on hand, if I ever need it, I'll have it, it's seasonal, uh, I had, I have no other reason other than that. But, uh, and then there was some dandelions and daisies and stuff. I figured I'd just grab those because they were, like, right there. So, not too exciting, but a little of this, a little of that. Uh, fur. You know what we should do? Let's put this all away. And there we go. Let's put this all away. Oh! And one of the things we should actually... Hang on a minute. We should be checking. No, not the axe. Yes! Let's take a look at the repair situation. Is there anything that needs repair? Now we can actually look at the, well, there's the other way to do it is if you go into management and you go into buildings and you'll get little warnings. Right now, These this warning is because I don't have anybody at the well and this warning is because I don't have anybody at the sewing hut or at the workshop. So it looks like everything is in, like all the buildings are in good shape. So I could put uh, Mr. Bang Bang Happy Hammer away uh, and not worry about that. Um, now, are you all, yes, you're, pl you're, you're picking stuff, you're picking carrots, good, good, everybody's happy, but before the uh, day is through, hmm, I want to do a little bit of rework on the fields, because, uh, I'm not really too happy with the way this is all kind of organized and laid out, but I think, I, I'm gonna avoid uh, doing too much because, well, I'm not really sure. But we'll get into that. We'll get into that. Um, at a certain point, I'm going to, I'm going to rework the fields and, and, uh, but I'll leave that till when I actually do it. 
Um, what, do, what do we have to do for today? The immediate thing, though. We have to get rye so that we can plant the uh, a rye crop because that's going to have to be done by the end of the season. Um, I don't think, you know, rye, wheat is the other thing to be concerned about. But if I remember correctly, we have, how much wheat do we have? And we don't really have a good purpose for wheat right now, except maybe to sell it. Uh, wheat. We have 244 wheat. Um, technically what I could do is grab it. Uh, and also let's, uh, we got some sticks. We can put those away. Oh yeah, the food. I was going to put the food away. Uh, I could thresh the wheat and uh, sell some of the seed and keep some of the seed. That's probably, like, because I'm, I'm going to need money to buy the rye. It's getting very complicated. <laughs> it's, it's all very complicated. All right, the berries. I just grabbed a few berries, too. Uh, I'm going to keep that. The, that's my eating cabbage. Uh, the cheese, I'm going to sell that probably just because it's worth so much. And uh, I, I don't need it. And, yeah, you know what? I'm just going to sell it. The shade that no 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 not the cheese the meat uh, pear juice is for me and uh, St John's Wort now what is the food situation for the village I need to keep a, on top of this uh, what is that six ten eleven potage we have a lot of onions and a lot of meat you know what we could do let's grab that and let's grab uh, this stack of onions here. Uh, not the 37%, because we I'm going to let that rot for uh, uh, fertilizer. But I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to make sure that the, my people have food. Um, what am I going to need? We're, we're going to find out what we're going to need. I'm going to go in here and uh, see what, what, uh, what it is that we need in order to make what I think we want to make, which is like a meat stew. What is it that takes onions? Cabbage and meat. No. Uh, porridges? No. Other? Meat with gravy. That's it. Oh, it needs roasted meat and onions and a plate. Do I want to do that? Uh, it's, it's, you know what? We've got plenty of onions. It looks like, you know, it only takes one meat. So maybe I will do that. Uh, what am I? I'm going to need plates, though. So what do I need in order to make plates? Do, 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 do. We've got to go up to the workshop and see what uh, what the plates require. It's going to be some sort of wood-related thing. Uh, oh, that reminds me. Um, we need uh, one log. Make, one log makes uh, five plates. Okay. That reminds me. Uh, somebody had a good suggestion regarding the uh, the, the woodshed. And um, I'm going to actually implement that because I think it makes sense. Uh, for now, I have the woodshed producing firewood. But we don't have enough production. What is it? Uh, no, it's extraction. Uh, we don't have enough people to do that. And really what I should be doing is just telling her, instead of converting a bunch of stuff into firewood... How about you convert it, uh, just just get logs. Logs are really, that's that's what I really need, because then I can I can convert firewood super quick uh, instead of letting my uh, my people do it, which they're a bit slower. When I get more wood sheds with more workers, then I can sort of maybe balance this a little bit so that they're supplying their own firewood. But for now, uh, I want them to get as much firewood as they can, some sticks, and uh, a few planks, because planks are handy. Um, three planks isn't going to, like 10%, that's not going to cause a big dent in anything. So, all right. I think that's good. There we go. We've got that. Now, I need to uh, make some bowls and or plates, and I'm going to actually get the logs myself to do it. And I'm going to come up here, and you know what? We'll cut down some of these pine trees. I know they're not as efficient as the maple. They, they're, you, you, get, you don't get as much. Oh, it's a spruce. Okay. You don't get as much out of them. But, you know what, um, they're kind of away from the village, and I don't really need a huge amount, so this will this will be fine. It's three, I think, we get? Yeah, three. It's birch you get only uh, two out of. How about you? Do, 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 do. Timber! And then maybe, let's get this one here. Oh, I'm already overburdened! Oh, <laughs> awesome. 
This is going to be great. <laughs> more er, overburdened, even more overburdened. Excellent, excellent. Oh, you didn't fall? Okay. How about now? <laughs> On top of me? No. One, two, and where's the third one? Oh, there it is. Uh, somebody did mention, by the way, <laughs> I have a log in a tree somewhere. <laughs> That's really awesome. Uh, I'm not surprised. <laughs> I am not surprised at all uh, because I, <laughs> I, I was doing a lot of night falling, night, night, night logging, and you just, you just lose track of things. Um, I don't know. I think maybe it's over there somewhere, or it might be here. I'm not sure where it is. It's around. Now, we're going to leave her to her devices. Going to let her keep gathering logs. Apparently, she does that at the little uh, thing right there. So, we're not going to interrupt. No, not here. We need to go to the crafting bench. Do, 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 do. Now, this is not the only thing we're going to be doing today. There's, I've got a few ideas as to what I want to get uh, done. But we're going to just make a whole bunch of plates. Just so that we don't have to worry about them for a little while. Um, you know... It's this will this will cover us for a little bit. I don't have anybody working in the workshop right now, so uh, I have to do it. So I'm just going to overkill it. And then just uh, if we run out in the future at some point, then I'll deal with it then. There we go. And now I should be. Oh, I'm still over. Oh, crafting. Hey, and also I get some crafting out of it. Well, that's right. I've got tons of meat and um, uh, tons of meat and uh, onions on me as well. I forgot about that. So we're going to have to roast up the meat. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that's just, uh, yeah. Uh, and we do that here. So if we go RE. Ah, we'll do 43 meat. Is this going to take very long? Well, you know what? We'll use this as an opportunity to discuss what uh, the plan is for today. So uh, we'll, we'll listen to the, uh, the lovely sizzling of, uh, of meat on a stick. And... Uh, so I do want to go after that whole uh, big game thing. If you look in the upper right hand corner, you're going to see chapter eight, big, a big game. I need to get a bow and I need to hunt for moose, wisent, and bear. We do need to still continue the Alwyn story. My hope is that by doing this, uh, this uh, big game thing where I go hunt moose, wisent, and bear, that maybe I'll crank up my uh, hunting a little bit, uh, which means that I might be able to get rid of that sway that I have in my bow work. That would be kind of cool. Uh, the other thing we could try is maybe using a crossbow, but they're just so slow. What I really want is a recurve bow, and uh, so we're gonna have to we're gonna have to look at getting one of those. Um, but uh, the first step though is to get a bow. I currently have a long bow in my inventory, and I think that's probably why it hasn't registered. It says bow zero out of one. Um, we're gonna try. We're gonna investigate that a little bit. We're gonna see what what happens if I if I. Uh, I'll put my longbow in storage, and then I'll pull out the longbow, see if that triggers that. It probably won't. Put that back, pull out the bow, and see if that triggers it. It probably will. That's what I think is going to happen. On top of that, we have to keep track of the uh, the harvesting of the, the fields and all of that sort of business, and we have to get rye so that we make sure we, we've planted rye by the end of the season. After that... Um, <laughs> I need to, uh, well, I want to rework the fields eventually. Um, I, I need to make a new house, maybe, so that I could recruit. Well, if I need, if I recruit a, a new lady, I need a new house. Uh, if I recruit a dude and I want to put them with one of the existing ladies, then I don't need a new house. But I think having a new house, it's just going to be good anyway. So I'm going to build a new house so that when I go out and about, I can, if I find a villager, I can just grab them. They can uh, ask them to join me. So that's the other thing we need to get done. Um, we're going to sell a few things. Uh, oh, yeah. Somebody suggested, I think it was Badger. He said, like, you've got, you say you don't like the cudgel. Why are you keeping the cudgel? That's a very good point. So probably we're going to sell the cudgel and the, uh, oh, we're done. Uh, and then now we can go to other and we can make, I'm going to have to learn how to make it, I think. Where was it? Meeting with gravy. Uh, 150, we've got 897. Sure, why not? We just spent the money. Let's do that. R-E-F. We can get 43 meat with gravy out of this. This is really good. <laughs> it takes three meat to make one potage. It takes one meat, albeit cooked, to make meat with gravy. 
Do they like the meat with gravy better than the potage? I don't know. Is the is which one's better? I don't know. But I think that they'll be happy with meat and gravy. I like meat and gravy. So, yeah. So we're going to sell a few things, and we got to get the rye. And I have one last thing that I definitely want to do, and I'm not going to mention what it is, but I think it's super important. And so I'm going to try to do that. Like, that list that I just gave you, that's all the things I want to do within the next short while. But there's something I want to do by the end of today and uh, it, in this episode. So um, I'm just going to leave it at that, and we'll just go from there. Um, oh. Now, what I think I am going to do, though, is I'm going to interrupt this meat with gravy cooking. And we'll, I'll do this again, like, another time, because this is taking a little while. And quite frankly, it's a little bit boring. And I'm having trouble uh, continuing the dialogue so that this doesn't get... Uh, right now, it's just boring. Uh, I want to prevent it from getting excruciatingly boring. We're just going to have to do this. <laughs> there we go. Because this is just going to take a long time. All right. In fact, what I might do is I might put the bowls or the plates in here so that uh, next time I cook, I, I don't have to go and get them. And then all I have to worry about is the the uh, roasted meat and the um, uh, and the onions. The nice thing is that the meat supply ever since I got a hunter going is excellent. It's absolutely excellent. So there we go. And I'm going to put the roasted meat away as well. There we go. How's my weight? 39. What am I carrying? Oh, yeah. Sticks. Right. Uh, I need more arrows. Actually. Wait, wait, wait. There's another option. <gasps> okay. Let's grab all the feathers. And let's grab all... Uh, well, let's grab 50 sticks. I don't know. 49. Sure. And how much weight do I have left? A bunch. Let's grab uh, a bunch the equivalent of a bunch of stones. There, we're overburdened, but, oh yeah, I guess we are overburdened. Oh, there's so much, this game, I tell you, there's so much, wait a minute, how come they're not working? <gasps> they need fertilizer, they don't have fertilizer, they can't do, oh, that's right, I need to, this is the thing, oh my goodness. Okay, change of plans, <laughs> quick. <laughs> do I have any rot? Uh, here, grab the right-hand side, and we have two in here. That's not enough to worry about. You know what? Here, this is going to have to wait. I'm, well, it isn't. There it is, right there. I want to make these into into arrows. This this is quick. Making arrows is super quick. Whoa! Oh, hey there. How you doing, Lamberta? Man, that was kind of weird, actually. If I wanted to make a recurve bow, I would need to... I don't have enough t uh, technology, survival technology to make it yet, even if I wanted to. So let's just make a bunch of... Wait a minute. Actually, before we do that. Um, and then to make bolts, uh, I need to unlock the schema. You know what? We're just going to make arrows and be done with it. This is super quick. See, one, it, this this doesn't take long at all. And this will uh, unburden my weight quite heavily, quite quickly. Because, I don't know, somehow when you turn the stones into arrowheads, they uh, suddenly don't weigh as much. But I guess that makes sense. Oh, is that it? How many arrows do I have? Skills. Oh, that's right. I did uh, production. What can I do with this? Cooking knowledge. Yeah... Crafting expert, workshop, sewing, faster with a sewing, 10% faster cooking at the tavern, uh, sewing knowledge. You know what? I'm going to do that because I use it a lot. Although, you know what? I'm going to do the cooking skill because I do that a lot too. And builder. Oh, I should have done that one. Ah, well, whatever. Hey, hey Lempert, how you doing? I'm just going to check how many arrows I just made. Um, I just made, uh, how many arrows? We have 70. That's exactly what I thought. So we have a hundred in total. So that's, that'll, that's, that's more than enough. And, uh, she's busy doing, well, whatever it is that she does. Okay. We need fertilizer. Uh, I'm going to get them at least what I can right now, based on what we have as far as rot is concerned. So first of all, we're going to put away the feathers, the sticks, and the stones that we don't need anymore. I was going to do wheat, but oh, we still want to do wheat. 
But I do need to get that rot situation happening there. So let's see, what do we got for rot? 14. Did I put it somewhere else? How much do we have any fertilizer? I don't think we do. Fertilizer is a constant ongoing concern. Oh my goodness. Oh, and <laughs> there's so much that needs to be done. Do you see that? Both the bird and the ra and the uh, rabbit trap were, were caught. Uh, did I put uh, rot here? No? Okay, well, um, I can make one fertilizer. Could have sworn that we had fertilizer somewhere else. Did they convert that already? I don't know. All right, we need to get rye pronto. Uh, rye and fertilizer. Um, and we need to sell stuff. <sighs> we could sell the boots. We don't need them. There's the bow, by the way. Uh, actually, you know what? Let's do that right now. Let's do that little test. If we go in here and we do a we get rid of our bow. Now, if I pull in the long bow. Did that change anything? No. No, don't pull up the axe. If I pull in the bow, did that change anything? Yes. So I don't really care about having a bow on me, but does that still takes it off the list and it's no longer on the list? Good. Okay, so that's taken care of. What else can we sell? Um, the cudgel, uh, the unused crossbows. We've got a bunch of crossbows that we can, we can get rid of that one and that one. And I'm going to take the other one with me. Just, uh, I'm going to take 20 volts and I'm going to take, uh, this crossbow and, uh, wooden shovel, wooden hoe. That is probably stuff that's needed. Buckets. I mean, buckets are not worth anything. Um, beer bottle. Is there any any high ticket items? We could sell the beer bottles. We got a lot of them. Oh, oh, I didn't know that. The mead bottle. Uh, we could sell twenty of the linen thread. I'm not comfortable doing this, but uh, we need the money. Uh, we're gonna keep the flax seed. Um, leather. Why is it that we're not getting more leather? Is she out of knives? Hang on a sec. Is there any knives? Stone knife. There's two of them. So what's going on with hunting? Uh, hunting. She has a knife. Its durability is 23 out of 50. And I'm currently asking her to get 15% leather. 4.5. I must just be, that's not a lot, but the meat, this, this is probably more than we need right now. So let's get more leather. And yeah, fur and feathers. Okay. All right. Let's go into town. Am I forgetting something? Oh yeah. What is it? I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea, but we're going to go in and uh, get, we need, we need to get fertilizer and we need to get uh, um, what well, fertilizer and rye, so that's the that's the plan for the village today. And we'll we'll also check and see if there's any new dudes that have come by in the, in the in the in the new season. Perhaps somebody that has a three somewhere in their skill set. That would be kind of that would be kind of awesome. Um, inventory food, cabbage time. Um, what is it? F. Good enough. And uh, we'll get some water too. I'm a bit thirsty apparently. Oh, is there anything down by the water? No. Do, 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 do. Perfectly clean water. Nobody's going to get sick from it at all. I promise you, apparently, uh, not a thing in this game. <laughs> After playing so many games where drinking the, uh, the murky water is is uh is a problem it's kind of really only one madla boga madla boga she is a twos she's all twos okay all twos and ones oh, well that's a bummer um need a mirror what do you sell how can i help you <gasps> you're the trinket never disappoint oh you sell the trinkets 
oh, I'd love to get something for Baldwina, but we just don't have the cash and we've got so much we got to get done. Oh. See you soon. Need a mirror. I used to have a need a mirror in mine, in my uh, thing. And oh, here we go. This is uh, Dobrun. Hail, friend. Hail, how are you? Best goods in the valley. I know, but I've got some empty beer bottles here. And uh, there you go. And I've got one fertilizer. Uh, I've got a mead bottle. And I've got wheat that I'm not going to do anything with yet. I just have it on me. Um, we have uh, also, I could sell you a couple of cudgels. And how much money do you have? She, she's always got, she's loaded. So I don't mind selling her a bunch of stuff. Uh, let's see, what else can we sell her? Crossbows. That one's only worth 10, but that's fine. We'll sell her that one as well. We're up to 953. Not great, but not terrible. Um, yeah, I think we're good. I think we're good. Oh, and, and uh, two cheese wheels. Wow, that's not a lot. Okay, um, that's a little bit less than pear juice. No, I'm not selling the pear juice. Okay, farewell. Goodbye. Bye. Oh, sorry, excuse me. <laughs> All right, let's go. We need to... Oh, wow, look at her go. <laughs> Alwyn, you look very oh, excited. Yeah. Um, I would like to... Oh. Oh. I, I accidentally hit... Uh, can I help you with something? Winter is coming and we have no food stored. Last storm destroyed our cultivation. Could you bring us some grain so we can survive the winter? Um, okay. I'll, I'll be back with grain. Uh, how much does she does? How much does he want? Hang on a sec. If we go to journal. Wow. Okay. So, uh, oat grain twenty eight. Oh. Okay, how Edwin. My wares never disappoint. <laughs> Do you have any oat and oat grain? I need all of your oats. Three hundred and forty five. Oh, that hurts. Um, no, not, I don't, oh, I didn't, ah, what the hay, we need to make animal feed anyways. Uh, where's your rye? Uh, we need all of it. Oh, that hurts too. And then I need, uh, manure, and I'm going to get that elsewhere. Okay. Goodbye. Bye. And then we'll just, uh, we'll thresh the, uh, oat ourselves and give it back to him. Oh, that's just terrible. Oh, we did get... No, it doesn't matter. I don't care. <laughs> Did I screw that up? There. Probably, but I'm just not Whatever worrying about it right need, now. I've got it. I need, uh, wow, I need a lot of, um, I'm going to just get a, I'm just going to get a whole bunch. I'm going to impoverish myself and get 80 manure. Uh, I'm down to 61 ah. points. There See we go. Soon. Bye. <laughs> oh, sorry. Sorry. Oh my goodness, that was terrible. I I um pretty sure I messed up, but actually, you know what? I don't think I did. Um, I'm I'm not able to produce enough oat and rye right now to su to support all my needs, anyways. And uh, the only thing I messed up on was actually taking a quest. Um, and it's a quest that really I just I, I that's that's a feed. That's a, the oats. Is it oats? Yeah, oats. Oats are something that I have a heck of a time with right now. Um, now, we did just har harvest a big crop uh, of oats, but it was only 11 units, 11 um, plots on the field. And I don't know if we're gonna, how much oat we're going to get out of that. So that's why I just bought all of it, even though it's going to kill my finances. Oh, my goodness. Oh, wait a minute. We paid our taxes, didn't we? Uh, no, no debt. We're good. 399, did you see that? We're going to have to have... It's going to be higher, too, by the time uh, fall comes. Okay. What do we have to do? Oh, my goodness. This has just gotten so complicated. Um, oh, I forgot to sell the linen thread. That would have been good coin. Okay, good to know. I need to get them moving, so I need to make fertilizer. <laughs> Uh, and I also need to make rye grain. So we're going to do that. Let's thresh the rye. Okay. All right. Uh, let's thresh the rye. 
all 47 of it so that we can get them to plant the rye because the rye is what we need to plant this season. And then we'll also, um, I'm going to, while this is a good time, right? I'm going to, I'm going to undo all the field assignments so that nothing is assigned because this is one of the tips that people gave me was, well, if you just remove the field assignments, like just, just undo, like clear out all the seed types from the fields, then they shouldn't do anything with it. Uh, the other suggestion was whichever field they start uh, fertilizing, just make that the grain that you want or the, the seed, just seed that with whatever it is that you want to do that season. That's a good one too. And the best suggestion for the long term that I received was, and I'm and this one I really like. Okay, hang on, we're almost done. Let's just do, you know what? Let's just do the uh, oats as well. Uh, for the long term is I'm going to break up the fields. This is what I meant by reworking the fields. I'm going to break them up so that they're in like little units. Like there's just individual, like a checkerboard of, uh, of, of equally sized uh, plots. And then I could have, if I want a bunch of flax, I can set like four of them to flax and then one to something, carrots and one to cabbage, that kind of thing. And then basically just reassign as I need, as I go. I think that's, that seems to me to be like a, the best way to manage all of this stuff. Um, yeah, I, I, I like that. I think that's a good idea. So we're going to go that with that in the long route, in the long run, but not yet because we have uh, we have things we got to get done first here. So fertilizer, we need, we got 40. Oh, I still have to think about animal feed. Oh boy. I hear you, pig. There's a pig out there. There's a pig complaining. I think I know what they're complaining about. They're complaining about the, the poor quality of food. I understand. He's like, food's crap. <laughs> I know. There's not enough of it. I hear you, pig. I hear you. It's okay. I will make it right. You will be happy. I guarantee you. Okay? It's, it's fine. I think I, I still hear complaints but they're much lower level now <laughs> let's take a look i just want to double check was it you are you the one that's complaining <laughs> oh, you're, excuse me she's like no you may not check the food <laughs> no <laughs> oh i got passed <laughs> 50 percent. we're good eh. can i get out of here now oh that could have been dangerous i could have pigs like it's like, I'm going to make your life as difficult as possible because I'm a pig. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I doubt that's actually what happened, but. Oh, yeah. The other thing is uh, they can't do anything more today anyways because it's the end of their work day. So, oh, for crying out loud, let's just deal with this. I tell you. I'm like a chicken running around with my head cut off. It's absolutely hilarious. First thing is I'm going to get rid of the feathers. I'm going to get rid of the fur and the straw. I've got the wheat. I do want to thresh that. I'm going to thresh it tonight off camera. Okay, so that's that's this is what this is all about. And then I can sell some of the grain to get a bit of money. So we're not as destitute as it looks. We've got linen thread and we've got wheat grain that we're going to be able to sell. It's it's cool. We're we're fine. Uh, meat, pear juice, water skin. Okay, cabbage. How's the firewood situation? 41. You know what? Here. Let's just, uh, let's do this. Let's just get that. Let's just make some firewood. Just right now, so that I don't forget, because, uh, my people will get very upset with me. So this is 10 firewood, which is essentially at four each. It's going to be 40. Uh, it'll cover them for a little while. Um, okay, so. I want to go and I want to actually take a physical look at the fields and see what is and is not done. We can also look at the, uh, well, we could also unassign things. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to finish up this firewood business. I'm going to get a get some ducks in a row. And uh, I will come back. Uh, when it's not me doing a bunch of boring 
kind of crap like this. Okay, see you in a bit. Well, it is the next day. So we are in day two of fall. And, you know, there's something I should do. Uh, Baldwina. How is life treating you? <laughs> You're the best. <laughs> um, Let's see. Uh, Let's take a look. Where can I find? Can you move? How's our little kingdom doing? Uh, I want to see if she has any tips for us. Uh, all is up and running, Captain Husband. Okay, be well, goodbye. my lord. Okay, goodbye. So, uh, what have I done? Uh, overnight, I destroyed all the fields because they've been fully harvested, and now I can start from scratch. Uh, the other thing I, I did was I threshed all of the grains. So we have, well, not entirely all of it on us. Um, I have uh, 199 wheat. Uh, I set aside 45 for planting. Um, just because, and this is the 199 we're going to sell. I've got a bunch of straw on us, which we'll put into storage after we're done here. I have 47 rye and 117 oat. Now, um, I am going to, I do need to plant some rye. So I'm going to convert some of this into uh, animal feed, but I'm a little bit concerned. Let's take a look. It's at fifty percent still. I think be, with those two little pigs, I don't. I don't think we're in bad shape. So I'm just going to make a little bit. I am going to make. Well, how much do we have exactly? Um, we have forty-seven rye. Uh, how about if I made? Uh, if I if I made seven uh, of the animal feed, just to top it up a little bit, get just get us a little further along, and saved forty for planting. Or 45. No, I should have 45. You'll see why. I'll make it. Yeah, I'm just going to do a couple. Let's just do a couple of animal feed. Oh, that was actually just one. <laughs> well, we'll do that again. <laughs> there we go. It's just a couple of animal feed. And uh, why am I doing it in 45? Because I wanted to make the uh, the fields in units of 15. Um, uh, here, let's just fill this up a little bit. That There we go. It's 57%. That gives us a little bit of a buffer. And I will be reorganizing the fields in, in groups of 15. In the meantime, we do have uh, 115 oat grains that I can sell uh, some of them to uh, Edwin, right? But I'm going to plant uh, 45. So again, what we're going to do is... Uh, here. Hmm, I'm, I'm going to need more fertilizer. I think I only have 41. But... It'll make sense. It'll make sense. I've, there's a there's a plan. There's a plan. It's a really chaotic plan, but it is a plan. It's just really chaotic, as I said. So yeah, we're not going to plant wheat because we've got we're doing fine with wheat. We'll wait till next time for that. There's the next wheat opportunity uh, will be in the spring. So maybe we'll do some wheat then. Um, in the meantime, I am going to take uh, this rye grain, the 45, and I'm going to put it away for planting, and I'm going to take the oat grain. Uh, and I'm going to plant, I'm going to put away 45 at, well, I'm going to take, put away all of it except for, ooh, what, how much do I need to give to, uh, Edwin? 28 from 115. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you know what? I could do that in my head, but I'm not going to. That is, uh, 87. <laughs> so I'm putting away 87 of the, uh, the oat grain. Okay. And we're going to just take with us as much as we need to uh, make Edwin happy, which is 28, right? I've got linen thread. We've got some straw. I'm going to put the straw away. Um, that's actually really nice to have because we use it for so many different things. Uh, and there we go. So we're going to sell. We're going to eat. Well, we're going to give this to him for the quest. We're going to sell the wheat grain. We're going to sell the linen thread. Um, I think we don't have anything here. You know what? Here, that rot, it's got to go. There, no. Is there no other rot in here? Just that four. The unripe berries are coming along, by the way. Um, they're at 50%. Uh, there is a way you can, yeah, I'll implement it. There's a suggestion. Somebody said make a, a water thing, a barrel, a half barrel outside and dump them in there and then you won't forget about them. That's my biggest problem with dumping food so that it rots faster, uh, is that I always forget about it. Now, what was I gonna do? Oh, yes. And I'm going to come in here, and I'm going to go, and I'm going to take a look at, let's see, dried meat, no, we could sell dried meat, but potage, no, roasted meat, no, we could sell a bunch of the roasted meat, 
Look at that. It's five each. And it's almost... No, that's rot. I, I don't mind selling. You know what we're going to sell? We're going to sell carrots. We've got a whole boatload of carrots. Some of these are hundreds here. Um, how many can we carry? There's. We've got... Uh, what is it? Uh, 35. We could ca carry 35 kilograms of carrots. Okay. We could carry all 152. In fact, we could carry... There we go. Now we're at 59 out of 65. That's probably good. We could also sell the cherries. And we're still... Yeah, we're good enough. Okay, let's go. Let's go. So what are we going into town for? Well, we're going into town... There's a. There's one... Remember I told you that there's a project that I had in mind that I want to get done? Um, there's a bit of a hitch with that project. And there's a reason why I can't do it right away. And, uh, yeah, uh, it, it has to do with money. So <laughs> I need cash. <laughs> I need cash. Uh, and then in the next one, we're going to do the, uh, I think, yeah, in the next one, we're going to we're gonna get the big game and hunt and moose and wizen and bear. We're going to leave leave the village. But it, it for this first half of fall, I got to get these, I uh, got to get all the farming sorted. And I want to get them, by the end of this episode, I want to have my team uh, planting the rye field for the next, uh, yeah, basically I want them to plant the rye. Okay, first of all, we're going to come to Dobre, who's never here? How do you run a business, Dobrenega, when you're never in your office? Is it too early? You just, wait a minute. Oh, that's, um. No, that's uh, that's not Dobrynega. That's that's the uh, that tinker the not the tinker the uh, Nita Mira. That she's the she sells the trinkets. Where is Dobra? What? Well, okay. I'll tell you what. We'll talk to Edwin. Uh, here's the grain. <laughs> Thank you forever in your debt. I can teach you a thing or two about farming if you want. Sure. There we go. Oh, we unlocked the goose house. Oh, wow. We got the... <gasps> so that was actually not bad. Okay. I'll tell I tell you what. Um, let me see. Only what... the best products He's here. got 1,700 coins. We're fine. So I'm going to sell him all of this wheat grain. And I'm going to sell him all of the... See, we're at 1,000. I'm going to sell him all of that. Look at that. We're up to 1,500. You thought we were destitute, but we weren't. <laughs> and I'm going to sell him all of the carrots and all of the cherries. Oh, he can't. We've we've cleaned him out. We've got 1,800 coins. <laughs> Bye. See you soon. <laughs> now you see why I wanted to talk to Dobrenega. She has, she's got the cash. Hey, 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 hey. How can I help you? Where were you? Only the best products here. Well, I have some products too. I have some, these lovely cherries that I just grew on my own. Very own thing. We're up to 1,869 coins. Goodbye. Bye. Oh, my goodness. That's what I needed to do. Oh, and we need to get more uh, um, manure. We need to get uh, four, at least enough for four more fertilizer. Hell, friend. Whatever um, you need, I've got it. Do you carry manure? I can never... Yes, you do. Okay, so let's just get... Um, Oh, what the hay? We're going to need all of it. 183. There we go. So we're down to 1,686, but we're still way ahead. Okay, good. Goodbye. Bye. <laughs> and we can make a goose house, but um, I'm kind of reticent. To oh, yeah, I do want, I do need to make a goose house. The geese are amazing in this game. They're just like, uh, they're so entertaining, it's not funny. So I am. I do plan on uh, making a goose house. What is that? I think it's just a rock. Yeah, that's just a rock. Come on, drink, drink. There we go. All right, let's go. He's hungry, but that's you know what? Fine. Here, you want to eat? Here's eat some cabbage. There you go. Now, <laughs> get back to work. <laughs> it's like man. All I eat are cabbages. <laughs> well, life's rough, Rasimir. Life is rough. You've got a young family. You've got a, you're just starting out. Um, you have to make sacrifices, my boy. That's just the way it works. Um, and you know what? It, you 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 if uh, you can't, you should never ask your own people to do anything that you wouldn't be willing to do yourself. 
That's what it means to be a leader. Apparently. <laughs> so I've heard. Look at that. She's doing really well. She's doing her thing. Okay. <clears throat> so, now we have... Uh, there's a few things. First of all, I got the cash that I need. Uh, second of all, we got the manure. So we can make, uh, we can make a, um, uh, a bunch more fertilizer. I'm just going to get that out of the way. Um, fertilizer. Okay, we're going to get that out of the way. So, um, as I say, before the end of this uh, episode, one of the things that I wanted to do was to make sure that we had set up our team so that they can get the, the, uh, the rye sorted out. And you notice that it, I did it in uh, sets of 45, uh, 15, so 45. Um, and that's just because I find four, 15 is a nice number. It's like the minimum that I'd want a field to be. And so making units of 15, I don't know. Is, am I going to adjust that in the future? Probably. Is it going to be too small in the future because we've got way more farmers and resources and everything? Yeah, probably. But... Uh, that'll be the case then. That is not now. Right now, we are dealing in smaller units because we're just a little village. That's the logic, at least. So, uh, lots of people, they work with bigger stuff, but um, we're just going to put that away. All right, so we now have uh, 71 fertilizer, which is more than we need. And so what I have to do now is just do exactly what I want done for this season, which is the... Which is the, let me see, should we start here? Go this way? Yeah. Rye. Okay, so we got to get our, do we need our hammer? I don't remember if we do. No, we don't. Okay, put the hammer away. Uh, there we go. What we need is to go into building, uh, farming, and then farm field. Okay, so we've got, there we got, we want to come back here. Uh, maybe do about here. Inside this tree, I don't know. Start here. Yeah, that'll. Nope, nope, that won't work. Too far over. Okay, fine. Building, farming. Uh, here. Oh, for crying out loud! Seriously. Okay. You know what? Go this way, and we'll do it here. Right, right here. All right. Can we, can I do this correctly? Maybe here? Yes! Ha <laughs> ha! We just need to figure out where the first one goes. So we're going to do uh, five, three by five. So, eh. Three by five. And then we just come over here and we do, and we just repeat. Uh, building, uh, farming, field. And then we go like right here and then over one. And then up. And over, and we do three by five, like that. <sighs> do I need to do something about that stump, or should I just uh, come up this way? Let's come up this way. Yeah, let's just do this. You, farming, field. There's our little post right there. Okay. And come up here. Three by five. All right, so there's our 45. Okay, and then what we can do is we go into, no, uh, management, oh, technology. Okay, we're going to look at that in a minute. Um, that's right. <laughs> so much going on. Ah. <laughs> Fields. We've got field one, two, and three, and we want those to be uh, rye. Now, the big question, and this is what I always have a kind of a, you know, let's just do this. I can never get the stupid symbols correct. All right, so the the... Two jauntily angled rye. There's the two, which is wheat. One is vertical, one is 45 degrees. The two that are kind of like, a, kind of curved, but you know what? I'm just going to go with, they look like that. Uh, there we go. And then we can do rye. And escape, accept. Yes. And we do that again. Can I do rye? No. Uh, rye, and there we go, accept, and uh, rye, and there we go, accept. All right. 
Hey, look at them. They're leaping into action. <laughs> now, the beauty of having the, the, the little independent fields like this is that both of them should be able to do it. If one doesn't, it might be because, nope, there he goes. There he goes. Uh, it may be because they don't have enough hose or something like that. Um, but the beauty of this is that, you know, uh, Rudolfina here, she can work on one field and um, Radost here can work on the other one. And so they can, they're parallelized and they'll be able to, like, they're small units. The, the, the way it works is uh, one person can work on one task on one field. And if you have, like, a huge, like, uh, max-sized field, then that means you've got one person who's going to do, has to do all the hoeing by themselves for that whole field. Whereas if you have these two little fields, you can make it so that there's, like, each one of them is doing. It, it, in the end, it's some, in most cases, it doesn't really matter. But for me, with such a small team, it kind of helps, right? And now they'll be able to fer uh, plant, fertilize, and all of that. So we don't have to worry about them. Yes. Okay, what is my project? Project. Project. The project. I want to make... And I've had this suggestion. This is people were suggesting this, but I want to make the meeting spot, the like the gathering area for the camp for the for the village. So a stone campfire. And in order for me to be able to, to do this, I needed to be able to unlock it and I needed 150 coins. And that's why I ran into trouble. So we now have the money for it. So there we go. Now we just need stones and firewood six firewood and 12 stones and we should be able to put this together now the big question is where are we going to put it that is the thing uh 12 no six firewood and 12 stones uh plus we're going to need some seating and all of that so i'm gonna have to figure that all out eventually um, but where are we going to put it? I think it should go right in the middle here, right, right in, right in here. I think this is, this is like right in the center of town. There's the farm district in the, uh, over here with the farm stuff. There's the business district over there, the housing district over there. The well is right there. I think that this little spot right here, I think is perfect for it. And you noticed I've not used it and it's because I kind of thought it would be a nice little communal area wasn't sure what to do with it yet and then somebody reminded me of making the uh, um, the who's and what's it's and I went oh yeah 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 sticks okay so just we're just gathering some of the resources that are kicking around here so I think it would be perfect right here so I'm gonna put it right on this deadly nightshade <laughs> why I don't know I because let's see if we can get it uh, is it flattish? Can make this work i think can't we there we go nice we could light this bad boy up there we go and now what i need is seating around it and i think we're probably going to have to um uh learn that as well not tables seats what i want is i need more building technology we could do stools uh, log bench. Yeah, I can't make the wooden bench, but I can make a log bench. But it's 500 to buy. I don't want the sitting stumps. What about... I don't have the technology for you. We could make log stools. They're 250. Oh, I think the bench is... You know what? You go big or you go home. <laughs> We're just doing it. Is it... Is this a waste of money? Maybe. Is it going to make my, my village happy and have the, give them a place to hang out in the, uh, after a hard day's work? Yes, we're doing it. Um, let's grab, I don't know, 12. Just, I don't know if we're going to use all 12, but I think that, uh, I think that we will be able to make use of this. Okay, so here we go. Uh, let's see. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, it's not what we're here for. Uh, tables, no. They See, they look like stools, don't they? But they're not. Okay. So we're going to put one right there. 
Okay. And... Put one right over there. Uh, furniture, seats, bench. Here. Nice. Maybe one over on the far side there. Actually, I've got enough for six. Why don't we do this? Uh, let's plan. Let's plan for expansion. There. And one here. That. And. There. Oh yeah, that's perfect. There we go. And one right over there. I like it. <clears throat> I think this is great. And we've got a deadly nightshade right in the middle. It's, it's awesome. Now, can we do roads? <gasps> we can. So we could basically do uh, right here. And then go around that way. And then come to here. Come around this way. And through here. Come around this way. Here, come back right through here. Oh, it's just, it's excellent. Now, can I, can I, can I clean up some of this, uh, this as well? I can. There we go. You know what? That's going to do. Uh, I could probably try and clean up some of this in here, but I don't think I will. No, put that away. Put that away. There we go. So we have a, uh, in the evenings, we've got a place for them to come and hang out. The one last thing that I wanted to do is uh, it's up here. And it has to do with this. This here. Um, I think what's going to happen is that this business district. Hey, how you doing? Is going to come up through here. And then there's, there's a road on the far side and those are facing that way. I can see a row of manufacturing going up through here and facing onto a road over here. And so I think that's what we're going to do next. But um, it's going to go through these bushes. But I think what before we do that, in fact, what we're going to do is we're going to start off just by putting in a little road along the side of this one right through here like this just to start it. I don't want to... Well, you know what? We could just keep going. Uh, up through here. Like this. And then we could have, like, buildings in here. And... Up through here. that then have one that comes around behind this and comes through here to this road like that haha -ha! put that away <laughs> dude all right so we've got a little bit of the sort of we're starting to work on some of the uh the layout i might have to change this road placement maybe it's a little bit too close right there but we've got, look at this, we've got a few places we can put some more uh, manufacturing, uh, like uh, crafting area, crafting buildings. Um, we've made ourselves our nice little, uh, like, a, like a sort of a, a, this this guy right here, the, the sort of meeting place. And our folks, look at this, we've got rye being planted. These two fields have been planted with rye and now they're finally working on this last one. See, look at the efficiency. He's hoeing, 
she's fertilizing and they can just choo -choo -choo, and they will they will have this done in no time oh okay i think this is a good place to stop thank you very much everyone till next time you all have yourselves a great day bye, -bye.